My beloved people, I greet you all in the holy name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Jesus meets you to families and all those families who are joining GPS Robbins on Facebook. I believe that you all see regularly, daily, and I believe that the message is short sermons which are produced are blessing to you. Are you really blessed? You can tell it to me, you can send it to me through WhatsApp or you can just post on the comment section. We are always prepared to pray for you. You too can pray for me, for my family and also for Jesus Meets team members. I thank you for praying for all of us. My beloved people, even today, God's word is going to come towards you. Let me read it for you. 2 Chronicles chapter 7 and verses 1. Second Chronicles chapter 7 and the first verse. When Solomon had finished praying, fire came down from the heaven and consumed the burnt offerings and the sacrifices and the glory of the Lord filled the temple. Praise be to God. When Solomon prayed, the temple was filled by the fire from heaven. Even the priests were unable to stand so strong the anointing was there in the church. My beloved people, my beloved sisters and brothers, you all know that in the New Testament time, God uses the word temple. You and me are the temple of the Lord. You and me are the temple of the Lord. When fire came down, when Solomon finished praying, Amen. You may be saying, I don't have that experience. God will surely give you the same experience. When he will give me, brother, when we pray, you may be saying that the heavenly fire should come upon me. It should fall into my body. That's what you desire for, right? One thing, Solomon built the temple for the Lord. He built it in the Mount Moriah. Moriah means surrender. When we surrender ourselves, our spirit, soul and body and every unwanted thing that God never expects, you need to give it up. Never hurt the spirit of the Lord. If you have such thoughts, secondly, always be filled with the Holy Spirit and just pray. When you pray, you will receive the power. You may be poor or you may be a millionaire. Praise be to God. One thing you need to do, you need to surrender your life to God. God has given you the body. God given spiritual life. If you just yearn for the Holy Spirit, if you desire for it, I tell you, when you pray, you will feel the presence of the Lord. And others will say that when you pray, I see the power of the Lord flowing. That's what I tell you. Even today, God is going to give you graciously. And for that, I'm going to pray for you. Heavenly Father, you have the authority over heaven and the earth. You are a magnificent God. On the days of Solomon, when he dedicated the temple of the Lord, and when he prayed, and the fire from the heaven came down, Lord, and you said, you are the temple of the Lord. Even now, when your children pray, Oh, Father, from this moment, whenever they pray, let the power flow into them. And for whomever they pray, let all the people receive the power of the Lord and the presence of the Lord. Guide them, let them enjoy it, Lord. From this moment in your children's life, let them have increase, let them have peace and the grace of God uphold them. Thank you for hearing our prayers, Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. May God's name be glorified. Lord has given you a word according to his word on September 5th. God has spoken about the fire. Whenever you pray, the heavenly fire will fill you. There is no doubt on it. Don't forget to share it to others and share the love of God to others. Speak about the Holy Spirit. God's name will be glorified. If God wills, we'll meet again. God bless you. Our address, Jesus Meets Ministries, number 4, Kavarapalayam Main Road, Abadi, Chennai 54, India. 
ಟೆಲಿಫೋನ್ ನಂಬರ್ ನೈನ್ ಏಟ್ ಫೋರ್ ಒನ್ ಟೂ ಫೈವ್ ಟೂ ಏಟ್ ತ್ರೀ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಸೆವೆನ್ ಟೂ ಡಬಲ್ ನೈನ್ ಫೈವ್ ಫೋರ್ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ತ್ರೀ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ತ್ರೀ ಇಮೇಲ್ ಐ ಡಿ ಜಿ ಪಿ ಎಸ್ ರಾಬಿನ್ಸನ್ ಅಟ್ ಹಾಟ್ ಮೇಲ್ ಡಾಟ್ ಕಾಮ್ ಜಿ ಪಿ ಎಸ್ ಡಾಟ್ ಆಫೀಸ್ ಅಟ್ ಜೀಸಸ್ ಮಿಕ್ಸ್ ಡಾಟ್ ಒ ಆರ್ ಜಿ ವೆಬ್ಸೈಟ್ ಅಡ್ರೆಸ್ ಡಬ್ಲ್ಯೂ ಡಬ